assalamu alaikum viewers welcome to my channel you know why study if you are new on my channel please subscribe and press the bell icon so you will get the notification of all the new videos in this video we will try to learn that how to draw a chemical structure of your molecule and all the way will give a written overview of the chemical software because if you are working on any molecule or compound so you must know the chemical structure of that compound and you must know that how to draw that chemical structure of that compound so how to draw that chemical structure of your compound let's start in this tutorial i am taking the example of a isoflavone compound it is a isoflavone compound and here is a sugar is attached with it and here uh, with sugar there is a melonin compound is attached with it so it is a steering structure and here is the r r means that if in place of r there is h so it is melonin daisy uh, or if it is oh then it is melonin genesine so we will try to draw this structure so let's start but before drawing that structure i want to give a little bit overview of this chem sketch software about their windows or bonds or whatsoever first when in the left hand side so when we see that this icon when you click on it it's a periodic table of the element so here is their is their classification and color according to their block distribution as s block c block d block elements or whatsoever and if you click on any element like here so it gives its information that its complete name mass oxidation state electronic configuration and whatsoever here in general you can also check its sector how who have discovered it and in which year a uh, name of origin from where it is originated or is uh, atomic radio electron negativity and blah 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 and when in this side so there is also icon when you click on it it gives you the table of different elements like chain radical or cycle C group elements are radical miscellaneous the protecting group of the element radical and these are the amino acids and whatever you want to use so you can find it then there and third important icon is our list of elements is here when you click on it it gives you a lot of element like alkaloid amino acid aromatic g group carbohydrate stone ether and here here is uh, there are different category uh, like I, when i click on the alkaloid so here the, this different category a c a s c e c o and much more or vitamin so a b b to b and uh, e u and lot of here are some icon like uh, so, so here these are different elements and if you want to write so also you can take this and write whatever you use the name or like this and this is the uh, drawing the normal board or uh, these, these are drawing different boards and these are the board types that are stereo or time stereo and these are the RO and like this and these you can use it in your structure or building structure now let's start that how to draw our structure that we have taken as an example so first we <coughs> draw the compound that is a ring structure ring shape so we take here the three three click on it and another is attached as a third one is on this formal so when you do the structure and click so it will automatically 
related. So here is also there are two windows like there is a structure when you click on a structure so it will be this type of window. When you click on draw so it will be this type of icon. So you go to the structure and if you want that I didn't want to show the carbon name or a element name in the structure so select all control A go to the tool structure properties and here untick that all and apply so you see that all the name of that structures are uh, sorry the elements are high now when we see our structure so here is oxygen and here is oxygen or so we will start to draw the so click on here oxygen and when you bring the cursor here so the element name of here so click on it so it will convert it into that required one and here is also oxygen so now don't click on it now drag it because we have here so drag when you drag it so it will show the line and then leave it but here is a double bar so you can let that bar and click on it so it will convert it into double bar here is also you can drag it but here is a R so we can take the R from here bottom side and there are a different type of R so which one we want so I want this one this and left and click on it. Third one, other one is that here is also OH group. OH and these are the double ones. Click on O and drag it. O. Here is a double one. So here is a double one. Here, 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 here. Okay. Now we have drawn our molecule. Now we attach the other glucoside. So on this position. So go to the window and here you can in this one our beta D paranoid. So we can click on this and take this glucopyranol and which one we are uh, which position we want to attach it so click on that position we want to attach this position so click on it and on which here is this so this one here i want to attach so when you do this so click on it so it automatically draws Or attached. So now we want to attach the that melonal compound. So we will take this by selecting this the draw chain icon. Click on it, and then we want to attach it on this position. So select this position and draw it how many chains we have two chains so leave it now we have oxygen with double mod so click on oxygen here and drag it this one and also here is a double one so select and click so it will convert it into double one and here is the OH you see here is the OH so select and OH so if you want to delete if you have other one or you want to delete them so you can select this button and this 
Let's look at it for the other video. Our required structure. If you want to adjust it or bring it into the center like this, go to the draw and when you go to the draw, so it will convert it into this. When you click or place the cursor on any element, so it shows that it's a box. So now click and then drag it and put it anywhere, anywhere you want to see. And here you can adjust its position, command or whatever you want to do. And now control C, copy or from here also you can copy and paste it anywhere you want to keep it. Uh, convert it into a JPG or a deep format and you need to do your uh, required study either in pieces or uh, paper or whatever. So this is our video about how to draw your chemical structure of your compound. Hopefully it will help you if you have any theory regarding this so text or comment it thank you